if, if we were to just get a a small brief sell off here and, and the VIX kind of just jumped on us a little bit, that would mean that that volatility is and I grant, granted there's a bunch of other factors, but that volatility is relatively rich. And so you're likely to get a response from volatility sellers based on that volatility clustering that would kind of suppress the first move, if that question makes sense. It does make sense. I think your answer is embedded in your previous question, which is if we have a lot of VIX open interest, that means people have these calls, mm -hmm. right? So if you own the 20 calls and you bought them for $3 months ago, and now they're worth three cents, and then you know the VIX spikes and you're like, wow, my three cents turned into 50 cents. I'm pretty happy about that. Yeah. So now I'm going to go out there and, and, and hedge some of this, take some of my money that kind of got gifted back to me. And that ends up being another reflexive loop. So it's a function of the, you know, the behavior of crowds, which is something you can learn really easily on the floor. I, I know that, you know, you weren't talking about yourself, but this speaks to the whole like gamma suppression and charm. And whenever you, let me think about this more clearly. If you're a floor trader, right? And there's 10 guys in your pit and you've been on vacation. And the, for the last five days, brokers have come into the pit and done nothing but sell volatility. And you haven't been there. So now there's nine guys in the pit that all are just soaked with gamma. They have right. tons of it. So they keep lowering their price. And now you walk in after being on vacation and you're like, wow, gamma is really cheap. I'm going to buy some. So you don't have the same problem that they have because now they have to car car carry that theta every day from mm -hmm. a higher level. And you can walk in advantageously and buy at the best prices or the flip side, sell at the best prices. And knowing their position or knowing the, the, the open interest of the nine guys around you is helpful. It's mm. not necessarily, doesn't mean you can make money necessarily, but it's a statistically more likely event than having just no awareness or being guy number eight. 